Hello and welcome to my channel. In this tutorial we're gonna do a very easy stitch, two rows repeat, great for blankets, infinity scarf, hats, cardigans, so many uh, possibilities with this uh, stitch. I'm gonna use 4.0 millimeter crochet hook. This stitch works with odd number, so I have here 15 uh, chains. We're gonna skip the first three chains from the hook, one, two, three, and into the fourth uh, chain, we're gonna do in there a double crochet. And this row is gonna be double crochet in each chain until we finish this row. So we're gonna move to the next chain, double crochet, next chain, double crochet, and so on. You can use this, uh, with this stitch, you can use any yarn size. If you like to do, for example, a sweater or a vest. For blankets, I think it's perfect. It's quite warm and nice, this blanket. So double crochet in each uh, chain. You can use variegated yarn, you can change uh, colors, like every two rows you can uh, change color, if you like. I think this stitch uh, looks nice with any yarn size. So the last chain, I'm gonna do a double crochet also. Then we're gonna chain one, turn your work. And we're gonna do single crochet in each chain until we finish this row. So the first stitch, single crochet. Next stitch, single crochet. Yeah, I think this one is nice for so many things. For a vest or a sweater, well, use, uh, if you choose to work with the stitch, use uh, a thin yarn not so thick. For a blanket it's just perfect. And with this uh, stitch I will suggest that you use a half of number bigger or a whole number bigger the the crochet hook. Okay, so the last, the chain here, we're gonna go in there and we're gonna do a single crochet also, if I can get in there. Okay, now we're going to chain two, turn your work. So one of the rows, I said there are two rows repeat with the stitch. One row is single crochet in each uh, stitch, and the second row that you're going to repeat is this one that we're going to do now. So yarn over the hook, we're going to go to the first double crochet here, and we're going to do like a front post double crochet, but we're going to go around that twice. So once, yarn over the hook, go back again, around that double crochet, pull another loop, and now we have uh, five uh, loops. We're going to pass the yarn first through the first uh, four loops, pass the yarn to the last two. And now, if you put your work like this, yeah, you're going to see the next stitch, we're going to do a single crochet. Okay. Next stitch, you're going to go below and you're going to go to that double crochet. And we're going to repeat once, twice, pull the yarn to the first four loops, pull the yarn to the last two. Next stitch, single crochet. And we're going to alternate like this. So the next stitch, going to go to the double crochet there, not this one because that is the single crochet that we did there, and you're going to repeat. So the next stitch, single crochet. Next stitch, go to that double crochet, not this one. Once and twice. Next stitch, single crochet, 
next stitch you're gonna go below not this one because this is the single crochet you're gonna go to the next and we're gonna do a double uh, front post double crochet but we're gonna go twice next stitch single crochet next stitch is the double crochet where we're gonna uh, do a front post double crochet but twice we're gonna go around that just to make a puff let's say and the last stitch we're gonna do a single crochet <coughs> I'm gonna look like this and now we're gonna chain one turn your work and now we're gonna repeat the row with a single crochet in each stitch so the first stitch is here single crochet next stitch single crochet next stitch single crochet and so on single crochet in each stitch for a blanket this will go really fast especially if you use a little bit thicker the yarn chunky or bulky but if you don't like uh, these puffs to be so big you can go only once like a normal front post uh, double crochet and we have the chain two at the end here we're gonna go on top of the second chain and we're gonna do a single crochet also chain two and now we're gonna repeat the row with uh, pulling up loops like a front post uh, double crochet but uh, we're gonna go twice so yarn over the hook we're gonna go to the row below where we have this puff we're gonna go around that yeah and we're gonna repeat once twice pull the yarn to the first four loops pull the yarn to the last two next stitch single crochet next is the puff the front post double crochet once twice next stitch which is right next to the the columns let's say the this front post double crochet I'm gonna do a single crochet I'm gonna repeat next single crochet you see it's right there and you move to the next which is the front post double crochet but we're gonna go twice like I said if you feel like this uh, these are too thick you can go only once single crochet into the next stitch and we're gonna do a front post into the next next stitch single crochet next stitch is the front post double crochet we're just gonna go the row below the last stitch here we're gonna do a single crochet then you're gonna chain two or we're gonna chain one sorry and then you're gonna turn your work and you're gonna do a single crochet in each stitch this this is right to uh, quite uh, easy and you can uh, use your scrap yarn if you can want to get rid of yarn but just make sure that you use the same size yarn if you are to to do a scarf or infinity scarf or a blanket hmm. to the last stitch in here and we have the chain two in which we're gonna go on top of the second chain and do a single crochet and now we're gonna chain two turn your work and now we're gonna repeat the row with these uh, uh, puffs or front post double crochet and the sides are quite nice <coughs> the sides of the stitch so whatever you do you should finish with one row of single crochet on top and you're good to go well hope you like this uh, this stitch give it a try I will show you the sample okay, this is the the sample that I did so this is the the front and this is the back so the stitch is not reversible you might want to do like a vest a sweater a blanket or many other other things so these are the the sides so if you like uh, this stitch give it a try 
Hope you enjoyed this, working with this stitch. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.